Aloha everyone, this is Max with Asian Geek Squad. Welcome to our day one video with the Galaxy Fit 2. Today we're going to go over navigation, widgets, quick settings, and in general, just learning how to get around the device. All right, let's go ahead and get started. I want to just talk about a quick feature I really like about this watch. If you have a Samsung smartphone, it will sync the Do Not Disturb. There's a white circle with a line in the middle that means Do Not Disturb, and it's currently turned on for both the watch and my smartphone. And now if I turn it off on my phone, it automatically turns off on my watch. It's just a nice touch if you're in the Samsung ecosystem. All right, so first up, navigation. So we do have a home button and it's really hard to see. So I'll just put a picture here. I was able to capture it at a certain light and just trust that there's a home button here below the display. So just quick overview. On the left, you'll have your notifications. From the top, you have your quick settings. And here on the right, we have our widgets. When you're navigating, make sure you exaggerate it. So for example, if you're swiping from the top, you need to go all the way to the, from the top to trigger and also all the way from the sides. It takes some getting used to, but once you get the hang of it, it's pretty easy. So let's go ahead and review quick settings. First one here is the brightness. This one is the do not disturb. Music. This one is vibrate. You can turn it off or on. This one is water lock mode. The one below it is locate your phone. Night mode and options. When you tap on options, it's just power off or restart. Let's show you how to reorder those. And for that, you'll need your smartphone. Open up your Galaxy wearable app and scroll all the way down to advanced. Here on advanced, just tap edit quick panel. And now you'll see the different ones we just went over. You can just drag, customize, and you can also remove. One of the settings I'll be removing is music controller. That's not something I'll be using from my watch. And also good night mode. And once you're done, just tap save. Those two quick settings are gone and we're down to three panels. Next up, let's look at widgets. So here on the right, you will find the ones that I've chosen. I have my sleep, steps, workout, and my summary. You can customize these again on the app. So let's go ahead and open that up. On the home screen of the app, just scroll down, you'll see widgets. Here are the four that I have. You can reorder those by just tapping the arrow on the right. And you can add a lot more by just scrolling down. So these are your different options. Weather, water, stopwatch and timer, stress, music, heart rate, hand wash, and calendar. If you wanna add one, just tap the plus on the left side. And let's go ahead and move the calendar up to the top. Once you're done, tap save. Here on the watch, our first widget now is the calendar. Next up, let's go over notifications. When you have a new notification, you'll see this orange dot on the upper left. To view your notification, just swipe. And here we see the notification, just tap. And if you want, you can go ahead and quickly respond by tapping one of your preset messages. So as you can see here, no new notifications and our watch is currently on do not disturb with that icon. So we just went over navigation. Now let's show you how to customize the watch face. To customize the watch face, just open up your Samsung wearable app and on the bottom here, you'll see watch faces. And here are the watch faces that are available. The one that I currently have is the modern based on the font here and it has step and the date on the bottom. Big time is from the original Galaxy Fit. If you want more information, if there's one that you like, you can just tap and select it and it will quickly change on your watch. So I would suggest doing this until you find the one that you like. For me, I'm gonna go ahead and stick with this one for now. All right guys, well that is a quick day one video with navigation and customization of your Galaxy Fit 2. If you guys have any questions, leave us a comment down below. Thank you guys for watching. Aloha.